Today I'm going to talk to you about vulval irritation, a very common symptom that many women come to see their doctor with. I want you to remember that vulval irritation is not always thrush and it's important to make sure that we are treated appropriately. I first of all want to talk to you about vulval hygiene and that means no soap. You can use a soap substitute. Don't use any perfume bath products, including bath gels. No feminine deodorizers, no talcum powder, and please don't scrub with Dettol or pine tassel. Always check for allergies or a reaction to condoms or lubricants that you might be using for uh, intercourse. If you do have an irritation, wear 100% cotton uh, pads or tampons when you have a period. Cotton undies, preferably 100% cotton undies. Wipe your bottom with plain toilet paper and after you've had a wee, pat dry rather than rubbing. Don't wear any G-strings or tight pants or pantyhose when you've got an irritation. If you go swimming, please go and shower and get the chlorine or the salt water off immediately. Don't sit around in your wet bathers. Now, what can you do for treatment? Well, before you go and get any treatment, you can do some things to help soothe the irritation. Get yourself a plastic basin, uh, a wash basin, and put some warm water in it and put in a couple of tablespoons of either bicarb of soda or salt. Get a basin that will sit in the toilet. You can sit it in the actual toilet. Uh, it overlaps the toilet and you can sit in that as long as it's strong enough and it doesn't fall through. <laughs> um, and then soak in that water for about five to 10 minutes and pat dry you may find that that's very soothing. If you're still very itchy and it's driving you crazy, get a cold pack, but cover it in a towel. Don't put it directly onto your skin. And then go and see probably your pharmacist first. They'll usually give you treatment for thrush, so a candidal yeast infection. And if they do, please take the treatment the whole of the treatment. Take it for the length of time that it's been recommended. Because very often women will stop using treatment once the symptoms ease, but they may not have completed the treatment. If your symptoms are still persisting, please go and see your GP who should examine you and perhaps take a vaginal or a vulval swab to see if there are any particular organisms. And then the treatment will be recommended according to what the problem is. You can always continue to use the uh, salt baths or the bicarb of soda baths, but please see your GP and be examined. Remember, this is a very common symptom that women often experience. After the menopause, thrush doesn't usually occur. It can after, un, under some circumstances, but not often. So the doctor really needs to examine your vulva and check what the skin looks like and treat appropriately.